What does high score mean? New high score, is that bad? What does that mean? Does I break it? Hello everyone and welcome to Veteran Gaming Raid Shadow Legends, I am Aaron and this is uh, gonna be a video that may end up being a cry for help, a plea to the community because uh, I got I got some issues and it's not just me falling off the screen right there. I have no idea what I'm going to do and let me let me just set the stage for you. So first of all, I'm not complaining, things are going well. Uh, I just crossed like floor 94 in the Doom Tower, uh, which is a personal record for my squad right now. We're at what, 144 days in. We're hitting Nightmare and the Clan Boss. Um, so things are going well. But here is where my conundrum begins. First of all, I just got enough fragments the other day to summon Drexlar which was a really big deal that I needed right here, right now, this second, regardless of whether clan versus clan or a summon rush or anything was going on because he had an HP burn. Well, then I pulled primal shards and I was fortunate enough to get, he's hiding, where are you, Mordecai? He didn't want to come out and play. So we got Mordecai, which was awesome because now I have an HP burner and that's how I was able to progress so far inside the Doom Tower because it was the Frost Spider. Mordecai helped me take it down with Rathalos as a serious sidekick. So we're progressing again, right? We're rolling. I got the HP burner. So that was all bueno. But now I'm not entirely sure what I want to do. I have enough food to take up two champions. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Uh, so right here, I got two chickens and eight five-star food guys. So, I have Harima, Harima, I don't know how you say it. I have Harima here. She is outstanding in not only the arena specifically, but she can do some good things in some other dungeons, which I'm going to need. Um, but again, I don't have legendary books laying around, which makes her a tiny bit less effective, obviously, and I'd have to buy out her masteries, work on her gear, all that kind of fun stuff. She's a work in progress, but I can take her up to 60. So I got Drexart I can pull, level up to 50, and then immediately take up to six stars. I have Harima that I can take up to six stars, but I also have like Mordecai. Mordecai is somebody that should be going up. Sinesha is really good. Dark El Hain is really good in specific areas. And that's not to mention Tayrell. Tayrell's stuck at 40 down here, which is a shame. Not quite as big of a shame as Inquisitor Shamiel, probably. And Clan Boss mainstays like Toragi the Frog, uh, Fane to some extent. Uh, where is she? Venomage. But because I'm getting HP burners with Mordecai and Drexar coming up, I also picked up Magnar recently. Magnar has a ton of synergy with HP burners. So I'm kind of getting to the point where I'm tearing my hair out, right? I have... Two heroes that I can take up to 60, essentially. But I'm not entirely sure which ones. Clan boss can always use help, and I know it's the most important. I'm currently three-keying Nightmare right now every single week. Uh, Ultra Nightmare I need to get into, and I do have the beginnings of the unkillable team. I do have my Maneater up and rolling already. Uh, he isn't fully booked out yet, and his masteries, I'm not fully done yet, but he is a work in progress. So we have the beginnings of the unkillable team, but I'm kind of almost wondering if I should start working on like an HP burn team with Drexthar and Mordecai, and then Rathalos, obviously. I'm putting books into him, uh, but he's got, you know, the synergy with the HP burners. Uh, where is that? I know he has it somewhere. Is it the soul I don't know. Oh, here it is. It's the passive, obviously. Inflicts 50% more damage against targets under HP burn and receives less damage. So, do I need to start building my HP burn team? Because that's going to be good for Hydra, too. I just... I have nowhere... I have no idea what to do. And granted, I already said, right? This is an embarrassment of riches, kind of, for me. I have solid champions. Some people struggle not having good champions to build... I have the champions. The champions to build are not the issue. I just, I don't know how I want to get this done. Doom Priest is great, but I already have a fully built Doom Priest. 
so she obviously slides down in an account that's this young. But I just, I don't know. It hurts me to not take Toragi up knowing how good he is in clan boss. But, I mean, Harima and then Drekstar. Ugh. Because also, here, so here's the deal. Like, my missions, right? I'm going to take, I'll finish this one tomorrow. Because I'll be able to do 39 million damage tomorrow when it doesn't. I got that halfway through the day today. Ice Golem 17. Uh, I can do, it takes a little bit. But the rest of these I can take out. The 75 million is the next real mission here heading towards the Arbiter. That is going to be a bit of a stretch. So I'm going to need clan mission help before I get to stage 20 on all these here. And I just, I'm not entirely sure how to get it right now. Uh, just to show you my clan boss team I'm currently running is Elva with Orn, Rathalos, Undead, Death Knight, or the uh, Ultimate Death Knight, and then Frozen Banshee. I feel like I can do something a little bit better. I just, I gotta get them built. I don't know if Maneater is good enough to throw in right now. Just, ah, uh, this is such a conundrum. I don't know what to do. If you guys have any thoughts, feelings, helpful tips, pointers, please let me know. God knows I'm not perfect at this game and there's always room to improve. So if there's a team you guys are using... That is just phenomenal. If this HP burn team is something that is so good in so many areas and I need to get it up and rolling. So like focus on Mordecai, Magnar, and Drekstar. Maybe that's what I'll do. I just don't know what to do. I really think I'm going to use one of them on Harima. Just to give me that little bit of arena help. But I don't know. At the same time, my arena, I'm ending in gold 5 every single time. Because I'm just going in here and picking off the smallest teams. But I'll refresh it, you know, 10 times a day. But it gets me into gold 5 every single time. And I've already smashed out my arena arbiter missions. So other than, you know, like upgrading the Great Hall. I just, I, Harima is helpful. Don't get me wrong. And she's amazing. And I'm not trying to complain about her. But I just don't know if she's the priority to take up to 5 stars or to 6 stars right now. I just don't know what to do. Hopefully that you guys are kind of watching this being like, yeah, I don't know either. Because otherwise I'm going to feel silly. But I know clan boss is the most important thing. I need to get that ultra nightmare up and running. But I'm just not sure that's doable with the champions I have without a true unkillable lineup. Let me know what you guys think. I'm struggling. Whenever I decide to uh, <laughs> make a decision, when I decide to decide, I'll let you guys know. And uh, it's probably going to come at the next uh, next champion training event. I don't know. This is this is my stress face because I don't know what I'm going to do. If you guys have an idea, please let me know. Help me. Help me, raid community. I don't know what to do. If you enjoy the video, please, please, please give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget, if you're not playing raid and you want these kind of mind-blowing, agonizing questions, make sure you're clicking on the QR code on the screen or on the links down below. Get started. You're going to get a free Tayrell. He's in part of the decision. I don't know what to make. So you can immediately start jumping in and getting some good stuff on your account. That will also blow your mind. If you enjoyed the video, guys, please give me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss upcoming content. And as always, have fun. Good luck. So I got that going for me, which is nice.